additional trial for Alzheimer's drug. Hello and welcome to Inventiva. This is Palak Yadav presenting to you today's Big News. In a huge breakthrough, America's Food and Drug Administration, FDA, has sanctioned a conditional approval to a brand new drug, Aducanumab, which is to be marketed under the name Aduel for the treatment of Alzheimer's disease. Alzheimer's is a remorselessly degenerative disease which eventually leads to extreme helplessness not only for the patients but also for those who take care of them. This breakthrough approval of the FDA might give them a ray of hope. The benefits of this drug are yet to be revealed and the decision taken by the FDA is controversial as well. This illness accounts for almost 60 to 80% of a severely weakening condition that affects around 50 million people all over the globe. As the risk of dementia is directly proportional to age, with the world population growing older, this disease is spreading super fast. The cost of caring for people with this particular condition is estimated at around $1 trillion presently, and this cost is expected to reach $2 trillion within 8 to 9 years. Even if few have anticipated for an immediate cure, there remains a great unmet need for a medication that at the very least slows the progression of the Alzheimer's disease. Aduelm is the first medication addressed at the fundamental path pathophysiology of Alzheimer's disease. Some people are ecstatic about Biogen's victory. However, it is not universal in part due to the drug's arduous path to approval. It's a monoclonal antibody which is a specialized protein molecule that's part of the immune system that's been tailored to bind to a protein called beta amyloid which forms plaques in the brains of people with Alzheimer's disease and which many researchers have long suspected isn't just a symptom but at least part of the cause. Aduca Numab appears to decrease the quantity of beta amyloid in the brain. That is why the FDA have, has given its approval. According to the notion, this will decrease the progression of a cognitive decline. The evidence is less conclusive on this point. Alzheimer's patients have had few reasons to be hopeful. Big pharma and government-funded researchers will take notice. Aducanumab is a minor step towards greater ones which are on the way. As India's population ages, the number of people affected by dementia and Alzheimer's is estimated to be 7.6 million by 2030. This breakthrough might be an upcoming solution to this mystery.